Well, it is the Nissan NP200IS. It is a special version of the best-selling NP200, which we sell 2,000 odd a month of. But this vehicle speaks to the adventure and that's why we're on the beach. Uh, we're out at the uh, Nissan launch and I'm about to uh, attempt surfing. I've never done it before. Uh, I just want to send a shout out to my loved ones. I've had 27 good years so far, so whatever happens, happens. So the changes is in fact the accessory pack that makes it attractive. So we have bull bars, roll bars in very nice brushed aluminium. Of course you saw the funky decals, leather upholstery, um, Bluetooth enabled radio. So if you need to work in the car, you can. You don't only have to listen to your music, you can speak to the boss. Yeah, it's got some nice little touches to it. I mean, the wheels look fantastic. Uh, the decals on the side look pretty cool. Well, I think it's going to probably do quite well for them. Special versions always do well. We had to load it a few years ago. Then we had the cells last year that was quite dark and very nice black interior and exterior. And now this one, they really go like hotcakes. We have a limited number of 1,600. However, if the market demands like we had with cells, we will make extra ones because it's done in our factory. The accessories are factory fitted so that you don't compromise on your warranties and guarantees. It's an open market for people to take forward, it's got nothing there anymore, no more Bantam. So in, Nissan has cornered the market with this car, by default at least. I quite like how the car drives, I think it's very comfortable, um, easy to drive, and there was nothing really otherwise wrong with the car. Well you know the MP200 speaks to the market, and it works for the market. We launched the first one in 2008, um, and it's, it's a success recipe. Sales shows it against its closest competitor. Um, and we won't see a change in terms of chassis or platform very soon. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a little bit more expensive probably, I think. Um, but, uh, you know, you are probably going to get a few more bits and pieces with it as well, included in that price. And yeah, another, another good thing about the vehicle, it's got that tried and tested 1.5 diesel engine, uh, which is used in a number of the Nissan products. And it's, it's, it's very, very good. Indeed it is, and we would definitely go for the diesel over the petrol because of the way it delivers all that torque, perfect for a utility van. The 1.5 litre DCI comes in at 202,900, while the 1.6 litre petrol sits at just over 190,000.